Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to Fixes back to another video on my channel. Today we are actually going to be starting a new build series. Well actually, this video isn't going to be a part of the build series, this is just going to be seeing if the build series is possible, in the way that I think it should be. So, today what we're going to do is we're going to work on trying to build a missile reloading system thingy. I, I say a reloading system, essentially we're just going to try and slide some missiles onto some patches, and then try and fire them off, and hopefully that'll work. Uh, and that's all I really want to do, so let's get on with it, shall we? Okie dokie, so here we go. Let's go ahead and load up a vehicle real quick. We're going to go into presets, and essentially we're just going to go ahead and steal this thing, and we're going to use it, because I feel like we should. It's a decent missile, and it should work, so go ahead and cut this. Uh, make a new one, there we go. So we'll use this as our base missile. Okay, let's go ahead and paste it in. Actually, we'll put it in the right place. Okay, so this is going to work via this, it's going to work that way around, and that is excellent. Good. What we're then going to do is actually delete this piece right here. We're going to go ahead and get ourselves a gripper. And that is going to essentially go straight onto here, but we'll make it grey. Because reasons. Everything else is grey, why not make that grey? So, that's on there like that. Is this going to work the way that I've put it in? I don't think so. I actually think we need to lift this up one. Alright, so grab this again, delete this, put it on there instead. Alright, excellent. And then delete this, and that is how it's gonna work. Alright, very good. We then need a pivot, so that we can actually start a new little little bit, if that makes sense. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and put this right here. And then we need a track thingamabobby, uh, and that should be good. One of these. Excellent. Yes. So that's gonna go on there like that. We're then gonna make this thing go forwards, uh, past this point. Oh, we can't. Ah, interesting. Very interesting. Hmm. Alright, so what that actually means then is that this is actually all going to have to go down. So, oh, I've just accidentally tapped out the game. Let me grab this, and grab this, and grab that. Go ahead and cut it. Move it down one. Paste it in. Merge it together. So this with this. Uh, there we go. Excellent. Uh, delete this piece, obviously. And then get the tracks again, and replace them in. Alright, here we go. So that's going to go there like that. It's also going to go here like this. And that is probably fine. Alright, excellent. So what this means is uh, that we can actually slide this along and everything should be good. So delete that. Get ourselves a new little thing. Alright, good. We need one of these real quick. Put that there. Excellent. Grab one of these and put it on here. There we go. Excellent. Delete this. Uh, put this here. There we go. So they're separate parts. Excellent. And then send this forwards. Very nice. Until a certain point where we'll have a hard point that will allow it to actually fire off, if that makes sense. So our whole thing is trying to get this onto there to fire it. Will that even work, is the question. We need some buttons so that we can actually fire them off, if that makes sense, uh, and then we should be good to go. So, yeah, good. So essentially, this will actually launch it, and that's it. <laughs> that's actually all we need. All right, very good. That's going to launch that one. Uh, then we need another one of these. So we essentially need to copy and paste this entire piece again. If that makes any sense at all. So copy this, move it backwards, paste it on the rear like this, and then grab a new one of these, paste it right there, merge this with this, and there we go. All right, good. Spawn it in. Preferably on the ground where it would actually be. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Well, it's not going to be on the ground, but still. There we go. So the rockets are lined up. That's excellent. Uh, let's go ahead and open this up real quick. We then need them to actually launch these. So essentially, I need to push this forward somehow. <laughs> I don't know how that's going to work. Alright, idea. For now, since it is separate pieces, what we'll actually do is this. Uh, down this side. And honestly, we'll actually go to this one and do this down this side. And they'll all actually be still. Okay, that's all we need. Them to stay still. Alright, push this forwards. Alright, they do actually slide, which is excellent. That does actually attach. Give it electricity. Fire. Okay, that worked. That is exactly what I wanted. Now launch this one forwards as well, onto there. And you see, oh, now it's attached, and launch it. Okay, right, no, the system works. This is perfect. So essentially, what we will be building is something like this. Uh, what will happen is we'll have a trailer, and we'll have a truck, the truck will be launching the missiles, the trailer will hold a bunch of uh, thingamabobbies that we can then push onto the truck, and then we can actually fire them. That is excellent though. That is actually pretty good. Yeah. 
So now we don't need to do anything complicated with the missile where we have to put a button on it uh, that makes it fire itself. Or a radio signal that means we have to send it to the truck. So this is good. This is actually a very good sign. Oh my... What just happened? I don't even know what just happened. But I can't actually return this to the base because uh, the rocket itself is the thing that we need to catch. And the rocket is flying around. I can't return this to the base. That's just not how it works. So close this up real quick. There we go. We're going to have to close up the other side as well so the rocket can't escape. There we go. And then we're going to have to respawn it again via grabbing it from wherever it's gone. All the way over there. All right, here we go. Grab it. Okay. Yep. As you guys can see, it's launched itself into a corner. Excellent. I can't actually grab it from there, but now we can get it. Good. So, this is our system. Hopefully, it'll work. The missiles are obviously going to have to be this big, so the back of the truck is going to be this big. As long as this works in theory, then it should work in um, practice. And in fact, the trailer could actually be too wide. So, we could actually have one there, one there, and then we could have them send themselves forwards uh, once we get to the right location. This is cool. This is very cool. So, in theory, then... All right, let's say we have this... Let's go ahead and get a bunch of these and do it a few times. So copy this, move it sideways, paste it there. All right, move it sideways again, paste it there. Move it sideways again, paste it there. Okay, merge um, this with this, this with this, this with this, because they'll all be connected together. This one will be connected all together as well, which makes it a little bit more stable on the ground. Excellent. And then, obviously, we need this to actually fire off all of them at the same time. What we're also going to do... Uh, no, we'll leave it as is. Alright, we'll leave it as is. So the problem that I see with this, then, is the fact that these guys don't actually have brakes on them that will actually work properly. So what we're gonna have to do, uh, unfortunately, is have a brake on them. And I'm not sh sure how I want that to work. So if we have a brake, uh, which actually is just a button. <laughs> there we go. So a toggle button goes there and a toggle button goes here. All right, so this will connect up to the brakes. So brake, 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 brake. Okay, good. Brake, 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 and brake. Okay, and we need this to automatically be on and this to automatically be on. Let's want it in. I don't know whether these brakes will actually work because they're on the back. No, they won't. They won't work. Okay, but we can push all these forwards until they're all somewhat connected. Excellent. And then we can fire them. Okay, excellent. No, this works. This does work. I need to come up with a brake system, though, because that's very important. That is really, really important, actually. All right, turn that off. Get these in the right location. Come on. Attach on, please. Oh, they're not going to. I don't think they're going to. Come on. Attach on. Jump on the top. Nope. Jump on it. Come on. How is that not even attaching to the gripper? Um, but yeah, this does work, in theory. The brake system doesn't work, which is very annoying, but... um. That's all right. That's okay. Oh, wait, what is happening here? Right, so we need to grab this. These will all fire into a wall, won't they? Yes, okay. But they don't explode straight away, which is nice. <laughs> so grab these. Right, we need to come up with a brake system for this. Unfortunately, it's a little bit annoying. But at the same time, it will be fine as long as we get it right. So pivot is what we need. Here we go, pivot. We're going to go ahead and put that right there. We're also going to go ahead and get ourselves a slider. Uh, which will go on there as well. I don't know what it's called, though. I think it's a track. Here we go. It's a track. So, this goes on here on the side. Uh, and essentially, we go ahead and we push this on here. And we have it send it all the way across. But we can't do it there, so we have to do it here. Okay, so that goes like that. Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't quite work that way. Because this piece actually needs to go on here first. So, this will go on here like this. Which will allow this bit to come out. And then we delete this piece. Put our little slider on it, uh, like this one. We're going to need a few of these, but that's okay. So put this here. No, actually, wait. We have to put it here. That's right. That's correct. All right, that's better. Put this right here as well, like this, and have this connect up with this. All right, okay, we're good. So slider is what we need. We need a throttle in order to actually control this, uh, and we'll see how this works. So... This is going to control this. This is going to control this. Excellent. All right, cool. Bam, bam, bam. Okay, so this is also going to work this way. So grab one of these. Uh, we need to merge that with that. Good. We need this to come back this way and go this way. There we go. So that locks it in there, if that makes sense. Spawn it in and see what that looks like. 
All right, so you see, it's locked in. If we then do this, obviously it slides out the way and it can move. If we do... Oh, <laughs> I need a minus number on this as well. So minus... Uh, da -da 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 -da. Max value, min value, minus one. Okay, so the brakes are obviously these little, these little things. So if we do this, removes the brakes. If we do this, should put the brakes back on. However, problems. Badge. They move automatically. What if we just had the brakes on anyway? What if we just had these slide forwards using this? I don't know. There's lots of questions. But anyway, remove this. It will slide backwards, but that's okay. Ah, that's definitely wrong. <laughs> that's that's definitely wrong. Um, But yeah, I guess that brake system does somewhat work. It just doesn't work perfectly. Because we can still move these around. They just can't slide out of there. Ooh, yeah. All right, okay. But once it's ready... So once all these are connected, that's actually fine. It is fine, because we fire these. Okay, excellent. Good. And then if we remove this, we send them all forwards, as we should. Okay, they're all in the right place. However, I forgot to turn this off. There we go, they're all correct, very good. And then we can fire them. Yes. All right, guys, we've got it. I don't think we're gonna use this system, but the rest of it that actually does work, works perfectly. So I'm actually really happy with this and I'm excited to move on with our build series. Okay, cool. Well, anyway, <laughs> thank you guys very much for watching whatever the heck this was. If you have an idea about the brake system on this that I can do, uh, that is easy enough, uh, then let me know in the comments down below. Uh, but for now, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed whatever the heck this was. And I hope you guys enjoy the build series that is about to start happening. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.